Hey everyone! Today we are making a vegan and gluten-free almond cake. It's also sugar-free and made with just raw, super healthy ingredients. Sounds yummy? Let's do this! For the almond cake, this is what we'll need. Ripe bananas, almond essence, flax seeds, almond milk, canola oil, a mix of almond and rice flour, baking powder, corn or potato starch and almond flakes. Start by putting the flax seeds in a bowl and pouring in the almond milk. Whisk until the mixture is uniform. Milk and flax seeds are some of the ingredients we we'll use to replace eggs. Time to mash some bananas. You can use a fork, a potato masher or a blender. It's important to use ripe bananas here. We use them to make our almond cake sweet without using refined sugars. It will be a much more nutritious and healthy cake this way. Ok, now get a big bowl and dip in the rice flour, almond flour, starch to get a fluffy dough, baking powder, and a pinch of salt. Give everything a good stir to make sure the baking powder is evenly distributed. Continue by adding a flax mixture, the mashed bananas, veggie oil and the almond essence. Now show that dough who's in charge. Give it a vigorous stir and turn it into a sticky butter. To bake the cake we are using a springform tin with a 24 cm diameter. Springform tins are great because they make it super easy to get the cake out without breaking it. Oil your tin well to guarantee the cake won't stick and give it a lovely crust. Now transfer in the butter and flatten it with a spatula. For extra almond flavour and a crunchy crust, top the cake with a generous amount of almond flakes. Once done, you can bake it at 170 degrees Celsius or 340 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 minutes in a static oven. Once ready, pop it out of the tin. If you wanted a simple yet delicious gluten-free and vegan almond cake, then you're done. But why not fill it with our super healthy vegan chocolate cream? It's a real treat made without any sugars or dairy. All you need is apples, which you'll turn into applesauce, and the darkest chocolate you can tolerate, which you'll melt in the microwave or bain-marie. Then mix the two until well combined and let the cream rest in the fridge for 30 minutes. You can find the link to the full recipe for this cream in the description. Now grab a cake wire or a long knife and slice the cake in half horizontally. A little trick we like to use is to insert two clean spatulas in between the layers and use them to lift the top of the cake without ruining it.
Now spread the cream over the cake in a thick layer around 1 cm thick. After 30 minutes our cream is nice and hard and the top layer won't squeeze it out once we put it back. Using the back of a spatula, make good the edges of the cake. Cute, right? It's also tasty and incredibly healthy. It's a vegan and gluten-free almond cake made with the simplest ingredients. If you like this kind of healthy recipes, then you'll be right at home with us at Foodaciously. So, Feel free to subscribe to our channel and most importantly reach out with any questions you may have in the comments. We'll be happy to help. Thanks, bye!